Hello, and welcome to another episode of Movies Anywhere Legacy Collection. Today's episode is about the Columbia Pictures films Men in Black. Now, the first one, Men in Black, was released to theaters on July 2nd, 1997. Oh, and, and all, all of these are also in co-production with Amblin Entertainment, by the way. But this film stars Tommy Lee Jones and Will Smith, Linda Fiorentino, Vincent Dornofrio, and Rip Torn. Well, anyway, this this film was um, was released on video cassette and DVD in 1997, and I have the 1997 video cassette right there. Then it was re-released on the collector's edition on video cassette, and then onto um, DVD in two in 2000 this this featured also featured a two disc deluxe limited edition box set yeah and this is this is a deluxe edition of uh, Men in Black and it was released to Blu-ray in 2008 and then it was also re-released but this time on a 4k Ultra HD on 2017 as well and before before I get on with the next one how about we take a look at these um, these editions here oops all right we got the 1997 video cassette and the um, 2000 DVD right here Alright, now this film led on to Men in Black 2, which was released to theaters on July 3rd, 2002. And this film also starred um, Tommy Lee Jones and Will Smith and Rip Torn. And this is also Rip Torn's um, last appearance on the series. He passed away in 2009, well, on July 2019, after the fourth uh, Men in Black film, but we'll get to that later. This one also co starred um, Laura Flynn Boyle, Johnny Knoxville, Rosario Dawson, and T Tony Shalhoub. This film was also released on video cassette and DVD in 2002 and that's what this is the 2002 video and DVD release then it came on Blu-ray in 2012 and it was also released on the 4K Ultra HD in 2017 so before I go on with the next films uh, let's take a look at the video cassette and DVD of Men in Black 2 right here. We got the front sides of, of those. Now let's go over to the other side there. And now the back. There's the other side of the, the video cassette. Now we're back to the front. <clears throat> Well, anyway, fellas, these films um, also led on to the next one, Men in Black 3, and that, that starred Will Smith and Tommy Lee Jones again, but this time it also uh, co-starred Josh Brolin, Jermaine Clement, Michael Strolberg, and Emma Thompson. This film was released in Berlin on May 14, 2012, and on May 25th, 2012 in the United States. Then this film um, came on to DVD and Blu-ray disc also in 2012 and on a 4K Ultra HD in um, well in uh, 2017 in honor of the entire Men in Black's um, 20th anniversary that year. 
And then, um, well, here's here's the last one right here, Men in Black International, and that that came to theaters. Uh, well, first in New York City on June 11, 2019, and on June 14, 2019, everywhere else in the United States. However, this film had an entirely new recruit: Chris Hemsworth, Tessa Thompson, Rebecca Ferguson. Kumail um, Nanjiani, Rafe Spall, Lauren Bourgeois, Larry Bourgeois, and also featured the return of Emma Thompson, and then last of all, Liam Neeson. This, uh, if memory serves, uh, oh, oh, you know what? This film has, um, has already been released on, uh, DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K Ultra HD on September of 2019. Now, in between all of those, there's also been an animated series called Men in Black the Series from October 11th, 1997 to June 30th, 2001. And it aired on the Kids WB as part of the WB channel. Oh, the, the WB channel and Kids uh, WB are part of um, Warner Brothers, by the way. So they're the block and television station that Warner Brothers owns. Well, that's it for this episode. Oh, oh, one more thing. Before we go, um, the entire Men in Black series is based on the comic book Men in Black, originally published by Malibu Comics, uh, a division of Marvel Comics in which Disney owns. Well, that's a wrap, so I will see you next time.